What up, YouTube? Double R Car Reviews. I'm about to head to um, AutoZone to pick up some paint so I could do the panels, you know what I'm saying, the seats, and, you know, my windshield wipers. I don't know which, which order I'm going to do it. I don't know if I'm going to do it all in one day, but we're going to get something done today, like I said. So stay tuned. I'm about to head to AutoZone. Go pick that up right now. So I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, we just made it to AutoZone. About to pick up this paint real quick. About to pick up a few cans. So let's go up in here and get these cans so I could paint these seats. There's, wind, there's windshield wipers. If I could paint these seats and these windshield wipers and my door panels. But I need to look for them first. We think the paint is in the back over there? Yeah. Oh, you got it in the cage? Oh, they're, they're over here. They out the cage actually. Yeah, right here. It's right here. The uh, yeah, right here. The vinyl fabric, duplicate color right here. Yeah, that's it right there. But that's black. Yeah, I need, I need, I need, I need one black for the door. I'm doing the panels black and red, black and red. So I need one of these. That's the one you need. Yep. Black. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Um, let me see the colors at. Or the reds, or oh, those those to paint the um the headers and shit like that. You could paint like the headers and stuff like that yeah. on the engine. I might I might do that. I might I might get a dress up kit. You know what I'm saying before I do that. Let me see. Let me look for these uh these cans and I'll be right back. All right, so I got these cans real quick. I just came up again, as you can see right here on the receipt. You know what I'm saying? Like you can see real good. Being I have some points on there. Get this focus real quick. I got these cans for six dollars, so I'm about to do some epic to my seats and my door panels and my windshield wipers. I only pay six dollars, so as soon as I get to the um, as soon as I get to the house, you know, I'll be right back. Hold on, Drew. Get it, Drew. Hey, get it, Drew. <laughs> got my belly in there, so that's like. <laughs> it's like three quarters of whatever you make just because my stomach was in that gym. All right, man. You see this nigga half ass J cleaning the seats. We about to we about to spray paint these seats. Right, we're gonna start with that. Once we get once we prep it up, we're we gonna come right back and show you the um, finishing touch. In the finishing touch, we're gonna show you the first coat, second coat, then you know the finishing touch right after. That's it. That's it. The sunglasses, yeah. See, she knew. Look at oh that. Oh my god. See how we hit that. They're trying to work, and we can't even work because they all they got jokes and shit. But anyways, like I said, this is right here. Make sure you clean the seat real good with some soap, some water, and some, and some alcohol. Or this the degreaser. I'm gonna get all that out right there. You gotta open up the pores. Yeah, you gotta open up the pores. You know what I'm saying? Open the pores. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, you got to open up the pores, man. Is so, it pores? Yes, it does. It does, it does have pores. <laughs> yeah, it does. Like, like skin. It really does. So, it's yeah. It's like when you put like a hot towel on your face, the same concept. Yo, you got to make it pores. It, That's what yeah, so pores. basically, yeah, you basically be opening up the pores so it, um, the dye can stick. Well, not the dye, the, the spray paint can stick to the seat. If it's not, it's going to be peeling on your butt and it's going to feel like plastic. And that's what we're going for. The plastic peel on your butt look. And we definitely not. We definitely not. For that, we go pay the eight hundred dollars. This is the cheap way to Joe, do you it. You did pretty good just now. I'm proud of you. Dude. I'm telling you, boy. Your boy working. Learning. Your boy learning. is working, working man. Learning. We're working. But like I said, we're gonna finish prepping this up, and then we're gonna hit the hit it with the first coat. So y'all gonna see that in a minute. All right. Now we adding the um the alcohol. Let me see the see all that dirt on there to get the rest of the, the last of it off before we start painting the first coat. We need some more alcohol. That's good. So, like I said, use the degreaser, scrub every every side, all the stitching real good. The last part, the alcohol, look all that dirt right there coming off. You want to make sure you get all that off so the paint can stick real good when it go when the when the pores open up. So, like I said, once we're done with that, you will see the first coat. We we just trying to make sure everything good. Make sure you get into them Yeah, cracks. because like I said, we was going to spray it before when I first said it, but as I started cleaning, it was still dirty. So we want to make sure it's thoroughly clean. Get, get everything. Like I said, don't rush. If it take longer, then let it take longer. It's going to be worth the wait. All right, he about to spray the primer on there. So what, what this basically primer does is it, it, it's for the paint to stick. So this is what you do. 
right after you clean your seats thoroughly with the degreaser and the alcohol, you let it dry and sit for a minute, and then you hit it with the primer. Make sure you shake your cans too. That's why you hear it in the background. How long are we gonna let that sit? Yeah, so we're gonna let this sit for a couple minutes. Make sure you shake all your cans thoroughly as well. Spray, spray it out in the air so you, you make sure it comes out fully. Make sure you get every angle, every inch, because like I said, you want it to stick. And you make sure you wear a mask. Yeah, you, you can wear a mask, but you don't do this at home. He's, he's a prefer. He's been doing this. He don't get sick. Like I, I got said, too many brain cells to fry. He got, he got extra brain cells that we don't got because I don't work construction right. with this dude. This dude do not wear a mask for nothing. He don't know what that is. He don't know what that is, man. All right, we going with coat number four. We're going to go a little bit more heavy. Being there was like a lot of the blotch spots there. So, and then like I said, once we done, we're going to sit it out in the sun more so it make it stick even more. Might have to do an extra coat, we're not sure yet, depending on how this one stick right here. I'm pretty sure you definitely gonna need another coat for it. Yeah, definitely. See how that, that's looking right there? That's where I need to stay, right there. But we're gonna put it out in the sun and make sure it's, when it would dry up, it look just like that. Always make sure we have enough cans because we got three, we still got the other side of the, the back of the seat left. So, worst case, you know, we're gonna have to get at least three more cans. But at the same time, like I said, this bottom seat shouldn't, shouldn't go after this can. I think we should have enough with this can right here. See how he's going with his hand, even flow. How you seen him do it from the beginning. Sweat. Yeah, definitely wash your sweat. I know it's hot outside. Definitely you want to do this in the hot weather so it can stick and go through the pores better. Because we had it out here in the shade, so it was blotching a lot. So we're going, like I said, he's going out there with heavy coats. And then we're going to sit it right back in the sun. We're going to move it from here. So he's going to finish up this coat. Like I said, I'll let you know how it turned out. Are you going to see the finishing product to see if we need a fifth one or not? Two. <laughs> this dude, man, never serious, man. Gotta love it. <laughs> we supposed to be, we supposed to be working on the car. Look at these dudes. <laughs> Big booty June working on his seat now. You know what I mean? He took off the windshield wipers right here. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to spray these white and the other the blade red. It's about to be a good look. By the seat dry over there. You know what I mean? About to hit with the first coat. All white. That's hitting, that's hitting quick. That's gonna hit quick. Like I said, we're going with the white and then the blade's gonna be red. That's quick. Definitely quick. How many coats you thinking? Uh, two. About two coats? Yeah, three just to get all the patches. Yeah. So we're gonna let that sit, cause this this gonna take about five, ten minutes roughly. It's all about the drying. Like I said, we in the preparation. So I said once it's done, it I'll hit you back. Lot. About to hit up the blades right here. Mm -hmm. Paint those red. Hitting it with the first coat right there. Going with the red and white theme. Gotta watch out because this, this dude already painted all over my damn shirt. He painted me instead of, instead of the blades. Looks like the enamel red. Yeah. See, when you ain't got nowhere to put it, man, you gotta, you gotta make something like this, man. Poor man's life. You know what I'm saying? You can't. You, you don't have to have a shot, man. You just invent stuff. You took a little, a little, a little string, hung it up right in the tree. Shit, let it, man, let that sit for a couple minutes. That's it. We're gonna let it sit for a couple minutes, or hit it with another, another coat. So we're going with the red and white thing. Like I said, the blaze red. You want to come back here? Huh? You want to come over here? 
and then the white right here so after we done i'm gonna let you see how it look like so they go to finish and touch right here as you can see this is how it's looking right there that's the look i was going for so now this is i got the white blades the white windshield wipers the red red white and black to go with the theme like i said we couldn't finish the seats due to the flooding so we're gonna get right back to that but this is the look right here i'm loving how it's coming out so no, 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 no. This, this this was just a bonus right here you know what i'm saying you know what I'm saying? My man half ass Jay blessed it. You know what I'm saying? If y'all need any custom work, highlight your boy. No, no, you just putting it close up like that. All up in your joint, man. We need to we're gonna give you the exposure, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, like I said, this is the uh the wipers came out, came out crazy. So uh, like I said, once we come back finishing the um the back the rest of the back seat, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna show you the finishing touch and also like I said, inside of my grill, I, I hate that it's white in there. So we're gonna do that too as an extra bonus on the video. Cause the video was about the seats. But we just added the rest, you know what I'm saying, to make one big fun video. We said what the heck, like I said, we just gonna do the grill, so we masking it off right here. Like I said, we was bored, we was gonna leave it for another day. But we gonna do it right now, real quick. And we fighting the light. And we fighting the light, like I said, man. Sometimes, you know, when you're a perfectionist, like this, seeing this, this been here for a long time. It was well overdue. I don't know why I didn't do it when I took off the bumper to put it on the grill. But hey, it is what it is. You about to uh, plastic dip this real quick? Cause I don't want to paint the bumper because I don't know what the future. What I'm gonna do in the future? So if I paint it black in there, then I'm gonna have to repaint it. All right, we just masked everything now we put a plastic bag in there so it'll get in the back of the radiator so now he's gonna hit up with the first coat yeah so we added on the first coat as you can see right here how many coats you think we need of that to give it that nice little black jet black look not too much because nobody gonna see it so two yeah. coats and two coats is enough and it don't gotta be perfect like i said see like right there yeah get a microfiber towel wipe all that off yeah, right here you need the out. You need the alcohol. Nah. So it's simple. You get it elsewhere. Like you didn't mask. Up, you didn't mask off. You just you just wipe it off with some alcohol. But and not even alcohol. Just rub it off. Just rub it off with a micro. It's, mic it's plastic dip. So, huh? oh yeah. yeah. So I mean, it's better to mask it off better. But we running on the time crunch. Yeah, we definitely running. On, we, we chasing the sun right now. You know what I'm saying? So we just trying to get it a, a nice, decent black where you don't see all the background, all the white. Let that dry up. We're doing the second coat right here. We had to mask off the rest of the car. It was getting all over the paint, so we improvised with the garbage bags. So you see how that's coming out. That's what I use for the, um, the, the emblem. We, 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 we switched up on the cans, on the duplicate color. We having a little problems with that, so we, you know, we're getting a better plastic dip. Thanks to Big Booty Joan, he came back, he came through in the clutch. So once we done with that and we got the grill back on, I'm going to show you the finishing touch. So here go the finishing touch. The sun definitely beat us, but it definitely came out real good. It looks more aggressive. But like I said, we're going to continue tomorrow because of the fact that my car got flooded. And like I said, the sun is going down. So I'll see y'all tomorrow. The next day. As you can see with the results with the seats, um, we, we ripping it off. We missing a heating gun. So we doing it by hand right now. As you can see, it's peeling off. Trying to take it off so it's just gonna take some time so we're gonna wait till we get our heating gun and we're gonna take all this off but you know what i'm saying my advice to do the duplicate color i wouldn't do it like i said this is my experience maybe other dudes they did it right the first time and like i said I, they didn't show the aftermath how long it took to crack but it cracked immediately this was, this was the first crack right here and it just kept going so we started ripping it off it was blotching a lot i don't know if it was the primer or not but i wouldn't advise you to do the paint on the seats like i said unless you want to be um Unless you want to be doing it over and over, I wouldn't do it. So I'm taking this off. So there it is, like I said. So so with that being said, you already know my slogan. If you got a Hemi flaunt it, if it ain't a V8, I don't want it. Peace.